Hi there! You've probably already experienced some of the awesome features of Geopulse, like precise location tracking, land level navigation, and found token quests. But did you know that if you are using the Geopulse Android app, you can actually export your precise location to another mapping software? Let me walk you through how to make that happen. First, open the Geopulse app and connect your device. Make sure Geopulse device is running properly and it gets into RTK Float or RTK Fix. Then, you will need to enable developer options on your Android phone. The steps may vary slightly depending on the model, but here's how to do it on a Google Pixel. Open the setting app, scroll down and tap About Phone. Find the build number and tap it multiple times. If prompted, enter your PIN number or login. You should see a message saying, you are now a developer. Now, go back to the previous screen and look for developer options at the bottom. If the steps above don't exactly match your phone, you can search online for specific instructions on how to enable the developer settings for your device. Now that you have enabled developer settings, the next step is to turn on the mock location feature. Go back to the settings. In the search setting text box, type M-O-C-K. Pick Select Mock Location app. It will jump to the setting item, click on it. Select Geopulse app. Now your Geopulse device is up and running, and the Mock Location setting is on. You can now switch to your regular mapping software, like Google Maps. The GPS coordinates you will see on the map are coming directly from Geopulse. Pretty cool, right? If you want to turn off Mock Location setting, you will need to exit developer mode, at least in Google Pixel 6. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give a like and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching and enjoy. GeoNet, mind the sky.